Hi friends, welcome to Turbomaz channel. In this video, we are going to solve three questions about PEMDAS rule. In the first question, we have 7 plus 18 then over 6 times 4 to the power of 2 minus 12 divided by 4. What is the answer of this question? In this question, we have parentheses, addition, multiplication, exponents, subtraction, and division. To solve this question, we need to follow the order of operations which is PEMDAS. PEMDAS shows the priority of the mathematical operations and if you don't pay attention to this rule, you get the wrong answer. As you know, in this rule, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. Multiplication and division have the same level of priority, also addition and subtraction have the same level of priority. When we have both in an expression, we start from the left and simplify the question. According to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify these parentheses. 7 plus 18 equals 25. Now the question is 25 over 6 times 4 to the power of 2, then minus 12 divided by 4. Okay guys, now we have multiplication, exponent, subtraction and division. First we do this exponent. 4 to the power of 2 equals 16. 25 over 6 times 16 minus 12 divided by 4. We have multiplication, subtraction, and division. First, we do this multiplication. 25 over 6 times 16 equals 400 over 6. Now we have 400 over 6 minus 12, then divided by 4. Okay, guys. Now we have subtraction and division. First, we do this division. Because division has higher priority than subtraction. Negative 12 divided by 4 equals negative 3. Now we have 400 over 6 minus 3. Since the denominator of this fraction is 6, we can write 3 as 18 over 6. Now the question is 400 over 6 minus 18 over 6. Okay guys. 400 over 6 minus 18 over 6 equals 382 over 6. Now we have 382 over 6. Because the numerator and the denominator of this fraction are divisible by 2, we divided both by 2. 382 divided by 2 equals 191, and 6 divided by 2 equals 3. The final answer of this question equals 191 over 3. Okay guys, let's solve another question. 100 minus 100 times 2, then over open parentheses, 5 minus 3 close parentheses, then all of them to the power of 2. What is the answer of this question? In this question, we have subtraction, multiplication, division, parentheses, and exponent. Again, to solve this question, we need to follow the PEMDAS rule. PEMDAS shows the priority of the mathematical operations. Parentheses, exponent, multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction. Let's simplify and solve this question step by step together. We have 100 minus 100 times 2, then divided by open parentheses, 5 minus 3 close parentheses, then all of them to the power of 2. Okay, guys. Now, according to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify these parentheses. Inside these parentheses, we have subtraction and multiplication. First, we simplify this multiplication. Because the multiplication has higher priority than subtraction. Negative 100 times 2 equals negative 200. Now we have 100 minus 200. 100 minus 200 equals negative 100. The final answer of this parenthesis equals negative 100. Okay guys, now we have negative 100 divided by open parenthesis, 5 minus 3 close parenthesis, then all of them to the power of 2. In this step, we have division, parentheses, subtraction, and exponent. Again, we simplify these parentheses. 5 minus 3 equals 2. Now the question is negative 100 divided by 2 to the power of 2. Now we have division and exponent. First, we simplify this exponent. Because exponent has higher priority than division. 2 to the power of 2 equals 4. Now the question is negative 100 divided by 4. 
Negative 100 divided by 4 equals negative 25. The final answer of this question equals negative 25. Okay guys, let's solve another question about PEMDAS rule. In this question, we have 3 plus open parentheses, 21 plus 7 close parentheses divided by 7, then times open parentheses, 21 plus 7 close parentheses. What is the answer of this question? In this question, we have addition, parentheses, division, and multiplication. Some people solve this question like this. They start from the left and they don't pay attention to the priority of the mathematical operations. They say 3 plus 21 plus 7, which equals 28, divided by 7, then times 21 plus 7, which equals 28. Again, they start from the left and simplify. 3 plus 28 equals 31. 31 divided by 7, then times 28. 31 divided by 7 equals 31 over 7. 31 over 7 times 28. 31 over 7 times 28 equals 124. They say the final answer of this question equals 124, but this answer is wrong. Let's solve this question step by step together. To solve this question, we need to follow the PEMDAS rule. PEMDAS shows the priority of the mathematical operations, and if you don't pay attention to this rule, you get the wrong answer. In this rule, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, a stands for addition and S stands for subtraction. As you know, multiplication and division have the same level of priority. Also, addition and subtraction have the same level of priority. When we have both in an expression, we start from the left and simplify the question. According to the PEMDAS rule, first we simplify these parentheses. 21 plus 7 equals 28. 3 plus 28 divided by 7, then times open parentheses 21 plus 7 close parentheses. Now we have addition, division, multiplication, and parentheses. Again, we simplify these parentheses. 21 plus 7 equals 28. Now the question is 3 plus 28 divided by 7, then times 28. Now we have addition, division, and multiplication. First, we simplify this division. 28 divided by 7 equals 4. Now the question is 3 plus 4, then times 28. Okay guys, now we have addition and multiplication. First, we simplify this multiplication. Because the multiplication has higher priority than addition. We have 4 times 28. 4 times 28 equals 112. Now we have 3 plus 112. 3 plus 112 equals 115. The final answer of this question equals 115. To see more mass videos, subscribe to the channel. Goodbye.